Hey guys, this here is City Hall uh, in Yucaipa, California, Yucaipa City Hall. They're open Monday through Thursday, which means Friday they're off. I don't know if that means they go out and do community involvement or if they just take Friday off. I don't know. Um, hopefully not because we pay them to, uh, you know, with our tax money to do what they do here. <coughs> Uh, yeah, I thought I'd come by here and see what's going on. <clears throat> there was a fire engine over here at the PD. And uh, I heard the, uh, the call for emergency on Yukaipa Boulevard. I didn't, because of all the static, I didn't know if it was a car accident or police action or what. So I came out here. But um, take you guys in real quick if they're open and show you the Yukaipa PD. Haven't been in there for a while. I don't know if they have new people in there or what, but I'll take you guys in there real quick. You know, they shouldn't be upset. Because uh, it puts you Kaipa, California on the map. And you know what's funny is city officials are all trying to make this like a Mayberry RFD. They're building all these new restaurants and eateries and so forth and trying to get people into town. So I wouldn't think they'd be upset. We show them off a little bit. What do y'all think? Think they'd be upset? But, uh, yeah, they have the Ukaipa flag and the San Marino County Sheriff's flag going. And then I think on the other pole is the American and California flag. Oh, hold on. That, I'm looking at something. Yeah, that American flag better be the highest. I don't think it is. It doesn't look like it's higher than the other ones. What do you think? Yeah, the American flag is supposed to be taller. So they are open eight to five here. No pets are allowed. So we'll go in here real quick and look around. Oh, they have a fire going. They actually have a fire going? No, it has to be fake. Maybe not, it looks like they have a fire going. It's hot outside, yo. As you see, they got all their first place trophies up here. Third place here. And they do have restrooms, community room. That community room is usually where you go if you wanna to talk to a cop. Or if you file a complaint, you usually go in here to uh, to file the complaint or um, whatever. Oh, I can feel the heat coming off of that. That is a fire. Dude, I guess they're doing it for aesthetics because uh, it's hot outside, man. I figured I'd have the air going in here. I'm sweating, yo. I think somebody went to, so there was two people over there, now there's only one. People's Choice, hey, they got a People's Choice Award. I wonder what television show that was for. Huh, interesting. Is that from the Senate, like the Senate? It is, it's from uh, Senator, Rosalie's Ochoa Bogue. I love the Bogue family. Um, they are uh, <clears throat> members of the LDS Church along with myself. But yeah, that's from uh, Center for Tape and Recognition uh, from the 23rd District. And um, she's local, actually. So we're proud to have her up there. 
Who's this from? Oh, Mayor Dick Riddle. I remember him. This has to be old. Yeah, 2017, make a difference day. So there you go. I'll just wait and see if anybody is gonna come out. Um, they do have a med return box right here. So, oh, I guess this is where you sign in or something. Interesting, or you can make a video, I guess. Well, they are gonna have a, a police collector show, guys, June 2nd and 3rd. It's gonna be at the uh, National Orange Show, San Bernardino. That's on Arrowhead. So you go to that, you can see the, uh, I guess collectors show their, I guess it's for patches and stuff. I don't know what they do, what they collect. But they're gonna have Larry Wilcox and Robert Pine of Chips. So if you're a big 80s Chips fan, you should get out there and see these two guys right here. June 2nd and 3rd. There you go, guys. Type of PD. I need to get some air in that me. All right, guys. There you go.